The church is getting ready for the next World Youth Day. The massive gathering of young Catholics will take place in Panama in January of 2019. Yo no sé. Si voy a estar en Panamá, pero les puedo asegurar una cosa, que Pedro va a estar en Panamá. At the end of last year's World Youth Day in Krakow, Poland, Pope Francis said even if he doesn't attend the next one, Peter will be there. Father Joao Chacas, a native of Brazil, is in charge of World Youth Day in Panama. He joins us now from Rome. Father, how are the preparations going in Panama for the 2019 event? So we have been a lot of meetings with uh, the local committee of Panama uh, World Youth Day. So we had uh, several meetings here in Rome and we had uh, one meeting in Panama. Every week we have a kind of video conferences and um, we roll, write to each other. We had um, a big meeting here uh, in the last April with uh, around uh, 300 representatives of more than 100 countries and uh, around 50 movements and new communities. So there is a very strict collaboration between us, uh, our dicastery and the local committee of uh, World Youth Day 2019. At the same time, they have a good collaboration with uh, civil authorities uh, in the matters which um, the government is concerned. St. John Paul II started the World Youth Day tradition in 1986. The first international one was held in Argentina in 1987. How will this World Youth Day be different from previous ones? So uh, each World Youth Day has uh, its own uh, characteristics. It's difficult to, to know now what will be different, but it will be the first World Youth Day uh, in Central America. We had the two World Youth Days in North America. We had two in South America. We have uh, we had di different uh, events in Europe and in other parts of the of the the earth. But it will be the first time uh, World Youth Day will be in Central America. Uh, bishops from the whole region uh, asked together this uh, World Youth Day to be hosted in in Panama. So. There is the, the strong support of all the bishops in Central America and that will have, uh, of course, um, a very specific character of that place. But uh, I think it will, it will have also a very strong impact to have Pope Francis, we hope he will be able to be there, uh, so to have Pope Francis speaking in, in his own language, in his mother language. We could perceive it, uh, the impact of him speaking in Spanish when we had the, the meeting with the volunteers in Krakow. It was a very strong meeting and we hope he will be able to, to come over to World Youth Day in Panama and I think he will speak from his heart and very easily because it's his language. I, I hope it will be, uh, I'm sure uh, it will be a very good uh, and, and strong meeting. I'm sure it will be too, and it's nice to hear about all the preparations going so well. Father Joao Chacas, organizer for the next World Youth Day, thanks so much for talking with us about it. Thank you very much.